Hi, my name is Tally and I'm from the Valley and welcome to my new YouTube channel. A lot of people have been telling me to make a YouTube channel because I film um, my series called Tasting with Tally on Instagram TV and everyone's like, move to YouTube. So basically I wanted to be a food critic, but it turns out I needed a nutrition degree for that. So this old thing is means nothing, I guess. So here I am. I hope you guys like it. Um, this video is going to be me on my past vacation in Greece. And I basically say what I liked and what I didn't like. And if I figure out how to edit, I'm going to do tally marks. Like one is I didn't like it and five is I loved it. Get it? Because I'm tally, tally marks. Also just keep in mind that I'm really picky. So don't like fully take in my opinion. Like you should try everything that I tried. Yeah, I hope you guys like my video. And if you don't, um, don't dislike it. It's going to hurt my feelings. Watch it. Hello, welcome to Tasting with Tally. Um, we're actually in Mykonos, Greece, and I'm trying a chicken gyro for the first time. And you guys are gonna watch. Mm, I like it. I didn't expect to like it, honestly, but I actually really like it. It reminds me of the Israeli like shawarma dish, so it's like, it reminds me of home. And it's really good. And I think that it has chicken, um, some type of yogurt, onion, and oh my god, there's a cat. And french fries, and, and it's all wrapped in pita. A lot of you have been asking for more Tasting with Tali videos, so here I am working on my vacation. <laughs> Today we're trying a Greek pizza. It looks like it has feta cheese, olives, probably olive oil, and tomatoes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Tastes really good. I didn't think that the Greek knew how to take, make pizza, but this is really good. I actually get olives, onions, and feta cheese on my American pizzas, so I really like it. Um, do I suggest it? If you're in Greece, first try the Greek food, which I already did, so then after that, then you could eat pizza, but don't go straight to the pizza because this is in Italy. Um, I think that's all for now, but I do recommend it. It's really good. And it's not even falling, like, even at Domino's, your cheese will fall off, so. This is high-quality pizza. It was 12 euro, which is, like, I think an okay amount for all these toppings. So, yes, I recommend. Hey, today I'm trying this interesting pudding. Mm. I don't know. I think it's pudding. Let's go for it. It looks like it's chocolate sauce on jelly. Ooh. It tastes very sweet. I bet it has like condensed milk in it and honey. I like it. I have no idea what this is called, but they gave it to us on the house, so I like it. They were actually live on a ferry from Mykonos to Santorini, so I thought it'd be fun to do a tasting with Callie on Greek chips. So they have regular Lay's, but they're different flavor than usual. So today I'm going to be trying cocktail Lay's. Salt is regular, we have that at home. And oregano Lay's and pesto crackers. So let's start with the crackers because they're different brands. Mm. Wow, this is kind of cheesy. It tastes a lot like pesto pasta, like, I don't know if I like prefer these over regular crackers, but regular crackers is probably better than these, but they're cool to try. Okay. Mm Cocktail lays. These ones are really interesting. I don't even know what kind of cocktail it means, like margarita, I have no idea. I'm smell it. Smells like regular. Okay, a little one. This is like vinegar, a little bit of tomato. I don't know what's cocktail about it actually. It kind of tastes like salt and vinegar chips in my opinion. And I saw that they sold salt and vinegar chips, so I really don't understand why it's called a cocktail. But next, oregano. Okay, honestly, already tried these. But these ones are my favorite. 
they taste i like wish that they had these in america because they just taste really good it kind of tastes like like pizza crust kind of and i highly recommend these salt regular salt chips i think these are just regular lace i don't know why they named it salt you can't go wrong with plain lace these are really good okay um if you're in greece or if you ever see regular lace I recommend trying these oregano chips. Let me show you one. I didn't eat it. See, it has like little green oreganos and they're really good. So I highly recommend it. I'm trying this sweet from Greece. They didn't tell me the exact name in English, but, and they told me in Greece, but I don't remember what they said. So it's very stringy. I think it's gonna taste like cinnamon and there's also nuts. I opened it up for you guys. There's like nuts inside, so I'm gonna, Go ahead and eat it. Are you serious? The whole it tastes pretty cool. I think I like the outer layer better than the inner layer because the inner layer is nuts. Yeah. But it is like, it seems like it's like all different types of nuts with honey inside. But I actually really like the outer layer because it's like little thin noodles with cinnamon and honey. And yeah, if you're ever in Greece, I do recommend that you try it because it's really cool and different than American sweets. And I doubt it's that many calories, but calories don't count in Greece because I can't read the labels. Today we're outside at my Airbnb at Santorini. Today I'm trying Santorini marzipan. I've never had marzipan, but I've heard like a lot about it. There's like all these different fruits. I have no idea if they like taste the same or like I don't know so let's try hmm that's cool it doesn't really taste like a strawberry but let's see if another one tastes let's try this little apple oh they all taste the same. I can't really explain what they taste like. They taste like a mushy, kind of like clay maybe? But it tastes good. It's like a sweet, mushy, let's squish it for you. Yeah, it's pretty mushy. There's a stem. Let's see if I could eat it. Oh no, no, no that's not edible. I had to learn the hard way, but now you won't make that mistake i have no idea how to like explain what this is it's so different but yeah it's just kind of like almond flavor mush it's not bad i recommend you try it if you ever see marzipan today i'm gonna try a greek rose delight um what is this called so it's like a i don't really know what it is it's like a jelly but they just call it Rose Delight. So let's see. It looks like Turkish Delight, but obviously it's Greek Delight. Um, it comes in like these powdery little things. So let's try it. They're little squares with like powder on it. Oh wow. Hmm. I like it. it reminds me of my mario spray my mario rose water spray it's pretty good um if you're in greece or if you see this anywhere i do recommend trying it it's like a cool jelly and yeah i do recommend this and you can squish it tear it apart it's really like powdery jelly i think mine's melted right now i don't think that it's usually like this but yeah Try this rose light today.